Well, hello and welcome to Jimodism Total Notary Channel. And uh, what you basically do is that when you have your game capture, I right click on it and you click, of course, uh, filters. So if you want to add filters, you just click, right click on it and select filters. And here you go. And uh, here on the plus menu, you have all the different stuff you may want. Uh, the normal stuff you probably want to add on is color correction. And here I have 20% or 20 zero, yeah, 0 0.20 uh, of contrast to get rid of that little uh, kind of too much, uh, too, too little contrast that easily gets when you process videos and just stream them. So I just had to try to, you know, remove that. So mitigate that. So I have that as a default on the game capture. Now this is directly on the game capture, which means it uh, will be across any of the windows it this will be like the default um, so this is kind of the main if i would like to put on some special thing for only this scene i need to have the game capture in a group and if we switch to cinema i haven't of course if i go to filters i have the same settings on the filter here um, so if i want to add the filters to just this group i go I just add everything that I want on this. I add in a group and on the group I right click just like that and we click filters. Here we have a new section and here we can see these effects can add on. So I have an additional of 0 0.30 of contrast and I wanted to have 0 0.5. So I thought this would be, you know, plus basically. It basically adds it on, so it should work fine. We also have a bit of saturation, and up here we have apply LUT. And this is uh, an interesting little thing. Um, you can basically change the color value. So I, cho I chose this, uh, this uh, teal lows, orange highs thing. That's basically kind of cinematic and stuff. And uh, that basically has it. Uh, and of course I can have infinite different variants. If I just have them in groups, I can put on filters onto the group. And of course my cinematic lens effect um, and the, uh, whoops, and the black bars doesn't really affect, be, they're not very affected by like the different, you know, color settings and stuff, so yeah. Well, I hope that helped you to uh, basically understand how to set up filters in OBS. And you should definitely join my stream. So hit down the, the description and check out my little Twitch and I'll see you there. Then you'll probably see me in my, in my nice coverall that I don't use for this video. So that's cool. See you. Jimmy Dism signing out.